Are you mad at me? I may have just squished the cat in the door. You okay? Looks okay. Uh, Indianapolis weather update. It's nine degrees out. And it feels like negative seven or something. <sighs> Little place called Aspen. I did that joke yesterday. Anyway, what a chilly start to our Friday. And hello. We are off to a good start. It's sunny outside. Uh, they're going to come pretty soon and fix up the HVAC to make sure it's working properly. I was coming over here to show you some sun. Look at that. Look at the, the view outside. All right, well, hopefully they uh, can uh, update the HVAC so it's not so squeaky and squealy and uh, make sure we stay warm as the cold weather is here. All right, I'm back with lunch. Uh, heads up to our out of town viewers. You know it's cold if I'm not wearing a ball cap and I'm wearing one of these. It's cold. But here's what we got for lunch. We got some pizza, some garlic rolls, breadsticks, cheese sauce, and Alfredo. They make this Alfredo when you get there. We went to a place called Sal's. We've been there a thousand times. I've taken you with us. I'm out of breath because I ran in real quick. So I'm going to eat real quick and got to get to a meeting. So let's let's eat some sauce. Look at Harry Potter. Harry Potter talking to snakes. That's me as well. I never knew my parents either. I never knew my parents, Harry. I never knew them. Uh, good news, as I'm now in the light, it's still freezing. Uh, why do I put the logo to the side? For Tupac, obviously. Hey, we paid off a car today. How exciting is that? One of our cars has paid off. That's a great feeling that we, I don't know if we've ever had before. One time we've had that, so, woo uh, Both kids had great days at school. It's Friday, so they're home for the weekend. We start baseball super early in the morning, uh, nine o'clock for team practice. So we're gonna probably take it easy tonight, but it is so cold. Good day for a fire. Well, Harry Potter just let the snake loose and flucked Dewey or somebody's name in the cage. Dudley, Dewey, whatever. Okay, we're gonna go figure out some dinner, but the good news is the car's paid off. Boop, boop, boop. And stay tuned. This is called a teaser in the in the in the biz. The joke of the day is a doozy. Heidi's looking at me like I'm an idiot. But the joke of the day is we're sticking around for it. So we're making the old uh, pasta that we always have. We got some hamburger cooking. And we got water getting ready to boil, and we're gonna throw some rotini in. Awesome. Is that enough? No, not the whole thing. Yay, Luki! So there we go. And then we're gonna mix it together, put some cheese on it. We're gonna drain that first with all that grease. And there we go. So we got our pasta. Oh, pasta's over here. This is pasta. Trying to prevent it from overflowing because we have the hottest stove in the history of stoves. And we got our meat, added our ray, ragu, ragu sauce, and then we got a grilled cheese for the little guy. But here we go, this is all done. This is just on a low simmer. And we're waiting for the pasta. So we added some mozzarella cheese in here. Put the pasta, there it is. I had some Kobe Jack too, just because that's what we had. And I'm going like that. But we also are making some bread and butter. And then I'm gonna put some garlic powder on one of these for Heidi, but not for me, because I'm boring. But, nice little meal, huh? Yeah, look what we're making. Wild blueberry muffins. A good Friday evening when it's frigid cold out, pick me up. Luke's doing all the hard work. There they are. Starting to cook up a little bit. We just put them in. So they're gonna be delicious. They smell. Oh, looky here. Doesn't look awesome. They look so good. They smell so good. I wish you could smell them. We didn't have any uh, of the little muffin things, so we had to spray them, and now we're making sure that they all come out. Uh oh Nice and easy. But, look, they're done. Clean. 
It's gonna be great. Can't wait. Can't wait. Seriously, they smell so good. I can actually start to smell some things. Hooray! And uh, these smell delicious. All right, that is the end. Whoa, almost dropped you there. Sorry. That was the end of our Friday night. Our dinner was fantastic. Some great pasta. And then some great blueberry muffins. Luke did a great job of uh, putting everything together. All I really did was drain the blueberries, put them in the uh, little containers, and then test them a couple times in the oven. So he did a great job. He's our little chef. Uh, the weekend is here. And we celebrated by Heidi taking it easy. And we got out of her hair. And I went upstairs and played some Fortnite with all of Luke's friends. Which happened to be everybody on the baseball team. It was kind of funny. And I'm still undefeated. 8-0. And Luke is super annoyed because I literally was five feet from him for about an hour and a half. I just randomly may have played video games for an hour and a half. But, anyway. <laughs> Alright, we... <laughs> Luke is so annoyed with me. Uh, joke of the day. This came from a close friend. I know everybody wanted to hear this one. This is a good one. Are you listening? Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Heidi acts like she doesn't like the joke of the day, but she loves it. I know that you guys like it too. How do you stop Canadian bacon from curling in your pan? Oh, we got it. You take away their little brooms. <laughs> <laughs> you laughed. <laughs> Oh, isn't that great? All right, well, hopefully you and your family are nice and safe. Hopefully you um, are ready for the weekend. We've got baseball super early tomorrow morning and uh, just kind of hanging out the rest of the day. So we're excited about it. There's so much going on in Indianapolis this weekend because of the college football championship, but I don't think we're going to go downtown because it is a little petri dish of covid i have a feeling so we're going to stay away but hopefully you had a great day hopefully you're ready for the weekend and hopefully wherever you are it is uh, nice and warm and toasty because it is not here in indianapolis take care thanks again and again why how do you get the bacon from curling in your pan you take away the little brush get it talk to you later